If you are a vlogger, car reviewer, or just like to record in your Tesla for that one in a lifetime road trip, I want to share a few ideas on where to mount your cameras and what mounts to get. There are three mount positions that I use most in the Tesla Model 3. All items in this video are listed in the description. First is a GoPro mount placed to the right of the dashboard. This position is great to get the overall view of the driver, especially when you are driving a manual transmission, showing off your ridiculous Fast and Furious 22 gear shift. And since the GoPro has a wide angle camera, the passenger will also be in the shot. Make sure you get the GoPro mount that curve since most dashboards are not flat. The second is the most important mount. This mount is great for getting time lapse of the road while driving. Putting the GoPro up close to the windshield can record the whole scenery without having to adjust the exposure. Any other objects in the view between the GoPro and the windshield will cause the footage to adjust the exposure based on the condition. Take a look at this footage. Notice that the outside is overexposed due to the camera adjusting the exposure for the inside rather than the outside. But this is not the reason why this is the most important place to mount your GoPro. If you pair the GoPro with the swivel mount, you can adjust the direction 360 degrees. Just make sure to get the unofficial swivel mount. The official GoPro swivel mount has an extremely strong ball joint, and if you attempt to rotate it while it being mounted under the black enclosure, it will rip the enclosure apart. I learned from experience. The unofficial swivel mount has tactile feedback, and once the position is set, it will be much easier to operate when driving. There are two reasons why having a swivel mount is beneficial. One, I record the reactions of others when they see the Tesla Model 3. <laughs> Holy crap, that thing is huge! Why is it so big? That was the extra money. Believe it or not, the Model 3 is a rock star and people know it. Especially there are still not many of the Model 3 out there. 2. In case of road rage and you want to record evidence, and since the GoPro and swivel mount are quite discreet, people may not notice that they are being filmed, which is a great thing when you are in a road rage. I put the mount right behind the rear view mirror and under the black enclosure. This helps hide the mount from outside view without any footprint touching the windshield, keeping the Tesla Model 3 clean and minimal. The third mount is for the mirrorless camera. It supports the Panasonic GX8 plus Shure VP83 microphone with wind jammer. I put it in the middle to the rear where I can get both Nikki and I in the shot. This is another reason why the Tesla Model 3 is special, due to the all glass roof. You can stick the suction mount to more places, making this a great place to show off your 15 inch touchscreen and the people on board when doing time lapse or car vlog. To support such a beast, you will need a three section cups mount and make sure you mount it while the temperature inside the car is the same as outside. I would recommend you place the mount the whole night without the camera and wake up the next day to see if it stays. Thumbs up if you like the video, subscribe if you love it, and hit that notification button to get notified on my next video. Also, where do you mount your cameras in your car? Thanks for watching.